the meaning of the glorious quran translated by muhammad marmaduke pickthall surah 61 the ranks revealed at medina in the name of allah the most beneficent the most merciful all that is in the heavens and all that is in the earth glorifieth allah and he is the mighty the wise o ye who believe why say ye that which ye do not it is most hateful in the sight of allah that ye say that which ye do not lo allah loveth them who battle for his cause in ranks as if they were a solid structure and remember when moses said unto his people o my people why persecute ye me when ye well know that i am allah's messenger unto you so when they went astray allah sent their hearts astray and allah guideth not the evil living folk and when jesus son of mary said o children of israel lo i am the messenger of allah unto you confirming that which was revealed before me in the torah and bringing good tidings of a messenger who cometh after me whose name is the praised one yet when he hath come unto them with clear proofs they say this is mere magic and who doeth greater wrong than he who inventeth a lie against allah when he is summoned unto al-islam and allah guideth not wrongdoing folk fain would they put out the light of allah with their mouths but allah will perfect his light however much the disbelievers are averse he it is who hath sent his messenger with the guidance and the religion of truth that he may make it the conqueror of all religion however much idolaters may be averse o ye who believe shall i show you a commerce that will save you from a painful doom ye should believe in allah and his messenger and should strive for the cause of allah with your wealth and your lives that is better for you if ye did but know he will forgive you your sins and bring you into gardens underneath which rivers flow and pleasant dwellings in gardens of eden that is the supreme triumph and he will give you another blessing which ye love help from allah and present victory give good tidings o muhammad to the believers o ye who believe be allah's helpers even as jesus son of mary said unto the disciples who are my helpers for allah they said we are allah's helpers and a party of the children of israel believed while a party disbelieved then we strengthened those who believed against their foe and they became the uppermost surah 62 the congregation revealed at medina in the name of allah the most beneficent the most merciful all that is in the heavens and all that is in the earth glorifieth allah the sovereign lord the holy one the mighty the wise he it is who hath sent among the unlettered ones a messenger of their own to recite unto them his revelations and to make them grow and to teach them the scripture and wisdom though heretofore they were indeed in error manifest along with others of them who have not yet joined them he is the mighty the wise that is the bounty of allah which he giveth unto whom he will allah is of infinite bounty the likeness of those who are entrusted with the law of moses yet apply it not is as the likeness of the ass carrying books wretched is the likeness of folk who deny the revelations of allah and allah guideth not wrongdoing folk say o muhammad o ye who are jews if ye claim that ye are favored of allah apart from all mankind then long for death if ye are truthful but they will never long for it because of all that their own hands have sent before and allah is aware of evil doers say unto them o muhammad lo the death from which ye shrink will surely meet you and afterward ye will be returned unto the knower of the invisible and the visible and he will tell you what ye used to do o ye who believe when the call is heard for the prayer of the day of congregation haste unto remembrance of allah and leave your trading that is better for you if ye did but know 
and when the prayer is ended then disperse in the land and seek of allah's bounty and remember allah much that ye may be successful but when they spy some merchandise or pastime they break away to it and leave thee standing say that which allah hath is better than pastime and than merchandise and allah is the best of providers surah sixty three the hypocrites revealed at medina in the name of allah the most beneficent the most merciful when the hypocrites come unto thee o muhammad they say we bear witness that thou art indeed allah's messenger and allah knoweth that thou art indeed his messenger and allah beareth witness that the hypocrites indeed are speaking falsely they make their faith a pretext so that they may turn men from the way of allah verily evil is that which they are wont to do that is because they believed then disbelieved therefore their hearts are sealed so that they understand not and when thou seest them their figures please thee and if they speak thou givest ear unto their speech they are as though they were blocks of wood in striped cloaks they deem every shout to be against them they are the enemy so beware of them allah confound them how they are perverted and when it is said unto them come the messenger of allah will ask forgiveness for you they avert their faces and thou seest them turning away disdainful whether thou ask forgiveness for them or ask not forgiveness for them is all one for them allah will not forgive them lo allah guideth not the evil living folk they it is who say spend not on behalf of those who dwell with allah's messenger that they may disperse and go away from you when allah's are the treasures of the heavens and the earth but the hypocrites comprehend not they say surely if we return to al madina the mightier will soon drive out the weaker when might belongeth to allah and to his messenger and to the believers but the hypocrites know not o ye who believe let not your wealth nor your children distract you from remembrance of allah those who do so they are the losers and spend of that wherewith we have provided you before death cometh unto one of you and he saith my lord if only thou wouldst reprieve me for a little while then i would give alms and be among the righteous but allah reprieveth no soul when its term cometh and allah is informed of what ye do surah sixty four mutual disillusion revealed at makkah in the name of allah the most beneficent the most merciful all that is in the heavens and all that is in the earth glorifieth allah unto him belongeth sovereignty and unto him belongeth praise and he is able to do all things he it is who created you but one of you is a disbeliever and one of you is a believer and allah is seer of what ye do he created the heavens and the earth with truth and he shaped you and made good your shapes and unto him is the journeying he knoweth all that is in the heavens and the earth and he knoweth what ye conceal and what ye publish and allah is aware of what is in the breasts of men hath not the story reached you of those who disbelieved of old and so did taste the ill effects of their conduct and theirs will be a painful doom that was because their messengers from allah kept coming unto them with clear proofs of allah's sovereignty but they said shall mere mortals guide us so they disbelieved and turned away and allah was independent of them allah is absolute owner of praise those who disbelieve assert that they will not be raised again say unto them o muhammad yea verily by my lord ye will be raised again and then ye will be informed of what ye did and that is easy for allah so believe in allah and his messenger and the light which we have revealed and allah is informed of what ye do the day when he shall gather you unto the day of assembling that will be a day of mutual dissolution and whoso believeth in allah and doeth right he will remit him from his evil deeds and will bring him unto gardens underneath which rivers flow therein to abide for ever
that is the supreme triumph but those who disbelieve and deny our revelations such are owners of the fire they will abide therein a hapless journey's end no calamity befalleth save by allah's leave and whosoever believeth in allah he guideth his heart and allah is knower of all things obey allah and obey his messenger but if ye turn away then the duty of our messenger is only to convey the message plainly allah there is no god save him in allah therefore let believers put their trust o ye who believe lo among your wives and your children there are enemies for you therefore beware of them and if ye have face and overlook and forgive then lo allah is forgiving merciful your wealth and your children are only a temptation whereas allah with him is an immense reward so keep your duty to allah as best ye can and listen and obey and spend that is better for your souls and whoso is saved from his own greed such are the successful if ye lend unto allah a goodly loan he will double it for you and will forgive you for allah is responsive clement knower of the invisible and the visible the mighty the wise surah 65 divorce revealed at medina in the name of allah the most beneficent the most merciful o prophet when ye men put away women put them away for their legal period and reckon the period and keep your duty to allah your lord expel them not from their houses nor let them go forth unless they commit open immorality such are the limits imposed by allah and whoso transgresseth the law's limits he verily wrongeth his soul thou knowest not it may be that allah will afterward bring some new thing to pass then when they have reached their term take them back in kindness or part from them in kindness and call to witness two just men among you and keep your testimony upright for allah whoso believeth in allah and the last day is exhorted to act thus and whosoever keepeth his duty to allah allah will appoint a way out for him and will provide for him from a quarter whence he hath no expectation and whosoever putteth his trust in allah he will suffice him lo allah bringeth his command to pass allah hath a set measure for all things and for such of your women as despair of menstruation if ye doubt their period of waiting shall be three months along with those who have it not and for those with child their period shall be till they bring forth their burden and whosoever keepeth his duty to allah he maketh his course easy for him that is the commandment of allah which he revealeth unto you and whoso keepeth his duty to allah he will remit from him his evil deeds and magnify reward for him lodge them where ye dwell according to your wealth and harass them not so as to straighten life for them and if they are with child then spend for them till they bring forth their burden then if they give suck for you give them their due payment and consult together in kindness but if ye make difficulties for one another then let some other woman give suck for him the father of the child let him who hath abundance spend of his abundance and he whose provision is measured let him spend of that which allah hath given him allah asketh not of any soul save that which he hath given it allah will vouchsafe after hardship ease and how many a community revolted against the ordinance of its lord and his messengers and we called it to a stern account and punished it with dire punishment so that it tasted the ill effects of its conduct and the consequence of its conduct was loss allah hath prepared for them stern punishment so keep your duty to allah o men of understanding o ye who believe now allah hath sent down unto you a reminder a messenger reciting unto you the revelations of allah made plain that he may bring forth those who believe and do good works from darkness unto light and whoso believeth in allah and doeth right he will bring him into gardens underneath which rivers flow therein to abide for ever 
Allah hath made good provision for him. Allah it is who hath created seven heavens, and of the earth the like thereof. The commandment cometh down among them slowly, that ye may know that Allah is able to do all things, and that Allah surroundeth all things in knowledge. End of Surahs 61 to 65 of the Meaning of the Glorious Qur'an Recorded by Nicholas James Bridgewater in Tehran, Iran